the reason why black people and, and Mexicans interacted and started taking from each other was because they're living the close. Now, Mexicans took the zoot suit from the blacks, but they also changed it. You know, they made it more garish and made it more, you know, they, they, add a lot, they added a Mexicanism to it. Um, and, but they took from the Harlem style that eventually became everybody's style, you know. And so the same thing with lowrider culture, I tell people, yeah, it's black and brown. I mean, uh, Mexicans really developed the whole lowrider culture, but black people are right there. They started their own lowrider clubs. And they, were, they were eliminating from each other. I know the music was very black, and the Pachucos went into right into that uh, boogie woogie and all that music. They, they got into it, but then they started changing it and made it their own Spanish language style and everything else. There was always this connection. Hip hop, by the way, was always black and brown. Man, it was the Puerto Ricans that helped create hip hop, all five aspects of it. And then the Mexicans right away got into it. I remember in the late 70s and early 80s when Mexicans were already doing break dancing before anybody saw it. Nobody did break dancing in LA except Mexicans. It wasn't even black people. And it was all, they were getting it all from the back east. So I think what people don't get is the black and brown culture has always been, and that even when hip hop got low riding culture because of the West Coast and nobody knew those Mexicans, you know, they always thought it was black people. Because I go back east and That's they say, crazy. Yeah, they always say, oh, it's all these black people created. No, they, they were they were taken from the Mexicans. Snoop Dogg's the only guy that actually gives credit, you know. Yeah. And even the tattoos, as you know, yeah. the tattoos were all Mexican style that all these hip-hop people and basketball stars, mostly black, took it on and said, man, we love this stuff. They, I talked to people back east, they got these black and gray tattoos, and they think, oh, we see how black people create this culture. Said, no, they took from the Mexicans. Yeah. Only certain people understand that relationship between black and brown that I'm trying to tell people, it's always been that way, you know, that coming together.